Society still believes that. Yeah. I don't believe this day is finally no. uh, I've watched so many years of the other ones. Yeah, they stay at preschool right now. I walked in the Abbey's room last night. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to some girls' varsity soccer. I'm actually Steve Cass with my co-commentator, Sarah Babb. Actually, I will be uh, temporarily subbing in for Kyle Charlotte, who will be uh, taking my spot. He's still at practice, so uh, I am filling in. Tonight we have the Monomore Sharks versus Sturgis. Uh, East uh, should be a great game tonight. Senior night. Uh, quite a few seniors on this team that they were celebrating uh, before the start of the game. So, what do you think are the keys to the game tonight, Sarah? I think that a strong offense will be the key to the game tonight. I think Sharks need to put one in that as soon as they can. Yeah, I definitely agree. Um, if they can get on the board early tonight, I think that's definitely going to make the uh, momentum on their, uh, their side, so definitely agree with that. Um, I think they need to play smart, um, play possession ball, and I think also um, to make sure they don't push it too much, you know, play within their means and see uh, where the game takes them. And here we go, Monomoy with the ball. Starting it off. So, like I just said, talking about possession right now, um, and not forcing it. So I think they're definitely going to play smart. And we have Lions with the ball. Sturgis takes it back. Looks like Higgins sends it to the sideline, and it goes out of bounds. Sturgis goal kick. So right there, I think uh, you know they're seeing what Sturgis East is going to give them to see you know what they can you know take advantage of and I think it's a smart move to keep the ball out wide and um, see what your outside middies can do I think the Sharks are hungry tonight here we go Sturgis East with the goal kick little bounce there and Ganshaw with the ball looking out wide Sends it, but intercepted by Sturgis. Here we go. Nice little give and go by Sturgis East, but intercepted by the Sharks. Ganshaw sends it into the middle, 50-50, and Sturgis East with the ball. Out of bounds, Sharks ball. And Mahoney with the throw in. Looking to see what she has. Not much. They got to move around. And to Higgins. To Devers. She's looking to see what's open. Back to Higgins. Maybe outside wide to uh, Ryan. Little touch. The defense is very strong tonight. You can see they're trying to get them up the field. Yeah, definitely, and uh, trying to pressure it so, you know, lose possession right there. Here we go, Hess with the ball, Higgins looking out wide to Mahoney. She's looking, sends it back, and we're going to wrap it to the other side. Little switch, oh, little loss of possession with Sturgis. Boyle trying to get it to the outside. No luck. And Ganshaw with the clear. The Sharks are looking for some nice passes out here tonight. Oh, nice little give to the outside. Looking it in the middle. Can she make the cross? Oh, off the post. And it looks like a goal kick. You know, I like what they're trying to do, getting out wide and looking it back to cross it in, um, going to the far post. The Sharks came out very strong tonight. I think they're having a great game so far. They need to keep up the hard work. Yeah, and I think uh, the pressure um, that the Sharks are 
uh, with, with the, with the uh, start to see this. I'm sorry, bumbling my words, but uh, keeping the pressure on them is definitely uh, going into their favor. Here we go, Sharks again, trying to save it with Lions, and it goes out. Sturgis throwing. We'll see if they can get it out of their part of the field and try to attack. Here we go, 50-50 ball. Higgins with the ball, Devers, trying to get possession of it. And she's staying with it. So what are you seeing out there for Monomoy there, Sarah? The Sharks aren't letting much by them tonight. The defense is holding strong back there, and I think they're just looking for some great passing options to get down and get something on the board. Yeah, definitely, and I think eventually uh, if they can wear them down, uh, they'll definitely be able to get that goal in. And, you know, having a lead is always nice um, in this game. Here we go 50-50 ball to the Sharks. Sturgis, and it looks like a foul on Monomoy. Free kick to Sturgis. Let's see what they are looking at. And it looks like Maggie Sandlin with the free kick. 50-50 header. Hess with the ball. She loses control. And back to Sturgis. And I like what they're trying to do. The center mids are trying to play it out wide. It's open, and I think if they keep on doing that, um, they'll definitely get, uh, you know, their chances like they did before. Monomoy with throwing loss of possession. Uh, Sturgis ball. Looks like Hannah Blake with the throw in. Tossing it again. Monomoy there for the 50-50. And now Monomoy. With the throw in. Looking for a Monomoy player. Loses a little possession. Devers with the ball. A little give and go. Sturgis East, trying to see if they can get something going. Boyer with the ball to the outside. Sharks and, haven't let much pass them tonight. And that's good. You know, they, they definitely, you know, don't want to let up. You know, nothing easy uh, for tonight's game. Oh, looks like a free kick for Monomoy. I'm not sure what that was. We got, oh no, it's a throw in, my mistake. Throw in. Here we go, start, sir, just trying to recoup. And right now, it looks like they're just, you know, playing kickball right now, Sturgis. I think they just need to settle down a little bit and see if they can control and have possession and see, you know, what their forwards can do. I agree. Monomoy's had a great game of keeping the ball under the control. Devers with the ball, looking to see if someone's open. Little give and go with Higgins. Oh! Right thought. But I think if she played it out a little wider, she would have had a better chance of uh, connecting with her player. A little a foul on Hess. Free kick for Sturgis. Let's see what they start. They're going to try to play quick? No. They're going to set it up. Sandlin with the ball. And she looks to see what her options are. As she boots it down. And Monomoy with the kick out. 
The defense isn't letting anything pass them tonight. And they're playing smart. They're making sure they get to the ball. You know, right now, most of the 50-50 balls have been to Monomoy. Leah Nash is having a strong game back there on defense. Here we go. Stewart just with the throw in. Seeing what's open. Here we go. 50-50. Higgins to Lions. See if we can get going. And it's going to be Monomoy throw in. Here we go, Monomoy with the throw in. And dangerous, get, get a touch on it, shoot it. Blocked by Sturgis, and Sturgis wants to get the ball out. Little possession here. And kicks it up, Monomoy sends it back in. Hess with the ball, seeing what's out there, passes it back to Mahoney. Little touch. See, I think right there, instead of playing it back into where they came from, if they played it out to the other side, you know, there's more room and, you know, more chances to attack uh, Sturgis. I have to agree with that. Higgins sends the ball down to the right sideline. Monomoy with possession, Devers with the ball, looking to see what's going on. And Sturgis with the steal there. McSorley with the ball to the outside to Slover fighting for it here we go Monomoy again trying to see what's open if she goes out to the outside to Ryan little touch to Huss can she get it? Yes, to Lions. If she can get to the ball, she might want to look to cross it. Monomoy trying to get it back. Maybe try to get a corner. And still just clears it out. Churchill with the ball up. Monomoy throw in Ganshaw, looking to see what players are opening up. And nice throw in, leading Olsen. Pressure's on, press, keeping the pressure on with Olsen. Trying to lock it down there. Sturgis East looking to clear it out on their side. And it's going to be Monomoy throw in. we got a couple subs coming in. We have... Lexiora. Hannah Slater coming in. And, and Reese Hart coming in. Four subs for the Sharks. Pass with the ball. Look and see what's there. Hart trying to control it. Pass with the touch to the outside. Stir just with the ball. McSorley trying to uh, regain possession. As she does, little tap to Coleman. And number 16, Boyle with the ball and gets it stolen by the Sharks. She's going to try to keep it down there on their third of the field. Stir just sees is with the throw-in. Ganshaw's ready for it. She's been a starter since she was in eighth grade. She's a great goalie, and I know she's the 
she's definitely a bright spot in uh, Monomoy right now on the defense. Uh, all year she's been stable back there. And as a player, as a defense player, offensive player, having a strong goalie is definitely key. And you know that you play field hockey and having a strong goalie is definitely helpful for your team. For sure. Canchal holds it strong back there. She's doing a great job tonight. She's ready for it. And here we go. Sturgis with the ball and boots it out. I don't know what, if she was going for a field goal or uh, I don't know. It was pretty close, though. It was a little wide right. Here we go. Monomoy Sharks with the goal kick looking. Monomoy. Reese with the ball. And she's great defense and the steal. And couldn't. All right, folks, this is uh, going to let up the reins in a little second and hand it off to Liam Mon. Uh, Kyle Charlotte was supposed to be here, but I'm not sure if he got lost. Uh, so thank you for letting me live my high school experience of commentating again. Uh, this is definitely fun. And uh, here we go with Liam Mon. Thank you, thank you. Hello. Honored to be here today, folks. Thanks. The Sharks are having a strong year. The girls' soccer have actually, they were defeated, not undefeated at the beginning of the season, sorry. They were, they had a lot of strong games and I think they're ready for it tonight. Let's see the Sharks take home a dub. Leah Nash heading the ball in defense with Tahana Slater. He picks up the field. Intercepted by number 12 on Sturgis East. Dakota Hesse, number 10, is having a really strong game tonight, and it's impressive. She's only a freshman. She's having a really good game. We have a throw in, Dan Shaw. Got a corner for the Sharks here. Looks like Higgins will be taking it. We got Kate Cabri coming in for Abby Wallace. Goal kick for East. Sandland will be taking it for East down on their end. She seems to be taking a lot of their hits from back there tonight. We got a Sturgis East sub, number 13. Is coming in. Ryan Hart is coming in.
Another goal kick taken by Sandland. She seems to be key for Sturgis' defense tonight. Shark throwing here at the 30 yard line. Taken by Hannah Slater. Shark's offense is very strong tonight. They're trying to look to get one in. Shark Devil with the shot. Almost hit it right into the net. Going a little over. Maggie Dever has had an impressive season this year. I'm going to let you in. Number two, Mariana is just coming in. <laughs> Maggie Dever is looking to put one in for the Sharks. Abby Wallace is eager to put one in the net. Beautiful hit. Maggie Dever has the ball. Sends it off to Abby Hands, but number 13 on Sturgis East. Intercepts it. Sharks offense is really working hard tonight. You can tell. They have great dynamic. There hasn't been much action down on the defense end for the Sharks tonight. The Sharks are really trying to push the ball up to the top and get someone on the scoreboard. I'd like to see it happen soon. I'm excited to... Oh, Abby Hager just slid it on the ball. She seems to be scared. Sharks are eager tonight. They're ready to put them in the net. Dakota Hesse only being a freshman here at Monomoy on the starting lineup. Sharks are a pretty young team this year. Considering they only have five seniors, a lot of these girls are freshmen. It's really impressive. They've had a great season this year. Oh, 
Dakota Hesse has the ball. She's looking who the pass to. Abby Higgins receives it, but it is taken by Sturgis defender. Boyle has a shot for Sturgis East, one of the first tonight. Saved by Deanne Shaw, down the bullet. Kelsey Olsen is going in for Monomoy right now. Let's see who she's going in for. Nice step by Hannah Slater, sending it off to Hart. Deflected off by a West or East defender. Some more Monomoy subs coming in. We have Lions and Ventura. Nash sending Gabri up on the right wing. Seems like Sandland is defending. Oh, but deflects off Sandland. It looks like it's going to be a corner for the Sharks. The subs are taking out Hyora, Hesse, and Hart. Abby Higgins will be taking the corner for the Sharks. Seems like the Sharks have a tight formation on the corner. Looking to rush in. Uh, with a save by Duff as goalie. Kicks up the field. We got Lions versus Boyle down at midfield. Lions is ready for it. She's looking for a teammate to pass to. Nice pass to Nash. Nash sends it up. Got coach on the sideline, giving her input. Letting the girls know to pick it up. I would have checked. Sturgis East needs to settle the ball more. They haven't had it settled at all this game. Got another corner for the Sharks. Abby Higgins again taking it. She seems like the corner taker for the Sharks tonight. Oh, almost a goal by a East player on her own goal. But Sharks still have it down at the East side. Number 23 for Sturgis East. Simon is coming in. Ganshaw will be taking the throw on yet again. Beautiful throw, sending it in. A nice save by the goalie for East. Looks like she'll be kicking up. Nice punch! Team made on the side, she a nice punch. Now both teams are using the middle a lot tonight. It'd be nice to use some side play. I think Leah Nash is going down there. Let's see if Sturgis will take it up the wing or not. Beautiful head by Wallace. 
Klein settles the ball. Gets it in to Gabri. Gabri sends it into Abby Higgins. Oh, but no one's there. Sarks have had many opportunities tonight to take a shot on net, and they're trying to get one in. I really hope by the second half they'll have numbers on the scoreboard. I see just one in for a good point. Well, it seems to be a white right forward. We got Sandland on the goal kick for East. Sandland has been taking a lot of these hits tonight. I wonder. Oh, but a little far ahead. Goal kicks it up, reaches about the 40 yard line. And Kelsey also with amazing deflection, sending it back towards the goal. Maggie Dever settles the ball with her chest. And Sandlin tries to settle it, but we got Higgins, passes to Wallace. Wallace tries to send it in, deflected off Sandlin. Ventura sprint, sprinted after the ball, but seems to have slipped and rolled on a track. She's taking a knee. No. She looks hurt. Higgins is never going to have to do. Very tough player, so hoping she feels that. Ventura's one tough girl. She's already up and she's coming back to the bench with our trainer. Lions is subbing in for Ventura. Okay, Sharks the rope taken by Slater. Slater is only a freshman, but she's on, been on the team for two years now. She's been on varsity both years. She's doing a great job. Gancho sends it in with a throw in. Off to Wallace. Marky Trevor settles the ball. Oh, sends it to Abby Higgins. Oh, with a deflection by the East defender. They're keeping it in, though. The Sharks are keeping it in within the six round line, which appears that it is a corner for the Sharks. Again, taken by Abby Higgins. Oh, Kelsey tries to volley it in. Wallace has the ball. Another corner for the shark. Sharks are doing a great job of keeping it on the offense side tonight. They're not letting much by them. Game is still scoreless with about seven minutes left in the Getting close to Kelsey Olsen. Abby Wallace sends it in. And doesn't 
quite make it there. Chiefs does not want to let up another corner. They took it out to the sidelines, but Lions keeps it in. Again, East kicks it out to the sideline. It's going to be a shark throw here at the 20-yard line. Cantrell has had great throw in tonight. Oh, Matthew Tever has the ball right in front of the goal. Saved by number 20. The Sharks are not giving up tonight. They're ready to put one in. With about five minutes left in the half. It's cutting it close. Abby Higgins is not letting that ball leave. Hannah Slater stepping up to the 40 yard line, stopping the ball, kicking it in. Looks like a hand ball, but I'll still be seen. Seem to worry about it. It's good. Going for the Sharks. And so again, we'll be taking it. Steps the ball, sending it to Kelsey Olsen. They're going through, sending it to the right wing over to Hesse. Um, okay, seems like the coach doesn't agree with the crowd's reaction. Okay. Everyone has their own opinion. Nice to see a lot of Monomoy students out here coming to support their seniors. Abby Higgins is passing the ball to Lions down on the fence. The Sharks have had great passing up the sides tonight. Lions has the ball right in front of the goal. She cuts it. Just about to send it in when Sam Lynn stops it. Now it's a goal kick. The Sharks. Sharks have had the more possession this half, keeping it. Keeping the game has been much majority on the east side, and two minutes left in the half.
Kelsey with some great headers tonight. Got Hesse with the ball. Oh, but it's intercepted by number 13 on East. Reinhardt. Leah Nash is not letting anything by her tonight. She's having a great, strong game on defense. Come on, Maggie, let's go! You're just giving them space to play in. Yeah, we got some words of wisdom from the East Coast here on the sideline, letting the players know not to give the Sharks any more space. He wants them to be playing a tight game defensively. We got a throw in um, for East, number 20. Katie Ganshaw is really good about telling her players what the other opponent seems. Players are open. She really knows how to communicate with her sister Josie as well on the net. Oh, she is keeping it in. Abby Walls is sprinting on, but it is hit out by number 21 on Sturgis East. Oh, and by Hannah. Lions keeping the ball in. Olsen taking the ball up the field. Looking for someone open. Abby Higgins is open. Bar is still in. The goal is pretty far out. Hesse sends it in, but ball goes out. Looks like it's going to be a goal kick for East. Corner for Sharks. Possibly. Maybe. Yep. It's looking like a corner. Abby Higgins seems to be taking a corner kick. Another corner. Seems like East's strategy for this half was mainly getting the ball away and not really settling as much, whereas the Sharks playing a more attacking offensive game. So it's interesting to see. So that gives us, leads us to the half, 0-0. Um, zero, zero. Be a great half coming up. Both teams have a really strong half. I think the Sharks just need to put one in. And Turkish East is doing a great job of keeping away from the Sharks. They're settling the ball much more. And the Sharks are just looking for their best passing option.
Welcome back. <laughs> Starting off the second half, East has the ball. Looks like Boyle will be sending it back. I don't know, looking tricky. Sending it back to number 12. Number 12 on that team is McLaughlin. Both teams are coming out strong for the second half. Each team is destined to score. They are ready. Mm -hmm. 
Kelsey Olsen has the ball. She's picking up the field. She's about to break some ankles. Sends it over to Wallace on the right wing. Let's go! Wallace to the The Sharks are really looking to push the ball forward and go for the lead. Well, it's sent it to Maggie Dever, and now it's back to her at the corner. Sends it in. Oh! Just barely met. So close. Lucy Ryan steps to the ball, sending it back up the field. Sweat East did not seem to settle out, but Shannon sends it back up. We got number five here on the left wing. Just sent it off to 16. Blue. Higgins has the ball. The 50 yard line. Sends it to Wallace. Right on the right wing. Wallace always seems to be open and in the right place. Sends it in towards the net. Oh! Olsen was just there, about to hit it in. Barely missed it. Sharks defense and midfield really working together tonight to put the ball up to the forwards and win the net. You now steps to the ball. Olsen has the ball. Oh, seems to taking a fall, but Wallace has the ball at the right corner. Ooh, cuts it back. Sends it in to Higgins. Uh, the Sharks are right there. They're ready. A little over the net, but it's good. Got okay. a lot of chances tonight. A lot of shots on that, but hopefully there'll be one soon. Hussey on the ball at the left wing. Gets it to Abby Higgins. Mike Dever has the ball. She's bringing it up. Sends it to Higgins. Give and go. In the back now it's to Olsen. Right at the six yard line. Sandlin takes it. But Maggie Dever does not let that leave. Wallace had a beautiful shot. Oh, it's in. It's in. The Sharks have been working for that all night. They deserve that one. They've been working so hard. Looks like the assist is from Wallace to Hart. And, yeah. Great goal. Boyle is not letting her team get down. She's bringing the ball right to the 50 yard line, and she's ready to be back in this game. She's not going to let this one goal determine the rest of the night. Yeah. The 
Sharks are not letting this get to their heads. They are still working just as hard. Higgins and Dever has have had some great give and goes tonight. It's a good dynamic there. Hart keeping it in. Dever always knows when she's pass who she's passing to as soon as she gets the ball. ball giving it off to Dever. Dever hands it off to Wallace back in that right corner. Wallace sends it in just the block by number 22 on East. Abby Higgins has the ball settles it tries to shoot. Kelsey Olsen has a shot goes right over the net. Sharks are looking to put another one in the net. Sturgis is not letting this one goal get to them. They're really trying to move it out and get it to their offense. Yeah, we got the East Coast. Some advice from the sidelines. Ganshaw has the ball on defense. Sends it out wide to Mahoney on the sideline. Mahoney is fighting for that ball. Gansha has a ball and it deflects off an East player. A great step by number 22 on East. Fox. Chloe Fox. A shot by number 5 on East. Gansha with the save. Hesse sending it wide, but deflected off an East player. Nash is not letting this ball leave, but the header seems to have deflected backward, but Ganshaw does not seem worried. Tries to send it wide again. Maggie Dever rushing back with midfielder 11. McSorley on East. Kelsey Olsen is sent towards the net. Maggie Sandlin is fighting for the ball. Kelsey has gotten the ball. Looking for someone to pass to. Oh, no foul on that call, it seems, but Kelsey Olsen was tripped. Ref calls a foul on number 21. What seems to be a trip by Prophet on East. Tripping Higgins. Looks like Higgins will be taking this kick for the Sharks. In the past, she has shown to be very successful with her far out shot. So, let's see how this goes. Sharks are ready for Abby Higgins' kicks. Looks like she's go into the net, which she has done before and successfully completed multiple times. Oh, a beautiful kick, just barely saved by the goalie. Nice kick by Abby Higgins.
Sharks are really working together tonight to bring their one common goal of winning. We look like we have some Monomoy subs. Kate Capri, Alyssa Lyons, and Lexi Hyora are coming in. Sturgis is really working the ball down the field. They're really wanting a goal right here. Maggie Dever having a great defensive save. Wallace is rushing to number 15 on East. Maggie Dever steps through, sending it to Wallace, who has so much room, but Thailand is catching up. Seems to have been meeting her at the side. Sandland is trying to get the ball. It is a shark throw. Here come the subs. down. That was a really nice shot by the Sharks. Canshaw sending it back to Hyora. Hyora is kicking it up the field towards Abby Wallace again on the right wing. Abby Wallace is battling for that ball. East is keeping it in. Working slowly, but she passed it to space, but it just didn't get there. Looks like Lions is taking a run for Olsen receives the ball. She is on a breakaway down the field. Sends it off to Hesse. Hesse. Sharks are doing a good job Lions tonight. Lions has the ball. Of finding each other. Fans cheering you on. We got eighth grader Melissa Velasquez going in. Melissa is going in for Abby Wallace. Let's see what Mer Melissa has to bring tonight. <laughs> really good, I see. The Sharks are really pushing the ball up to the forward line tonight. Oh, seems like the refs have called a foul on Olsen. It seems to have been a push. I don't know. Olsen looks ready for Sturgis to kick the ball down the field again.
Number 19. Again, so again, the ball. Number 19 on Sturgis East. Morgan Fidley is coming in. Ganshaw kicked the ball. Hasn't had many of those tonight because it's been much new for him. Balls have, the Sharks have been keeping the ball on the east side most of the game. Ganshaw is having a great game communicating with her defense back there. Nash is not letting anything pass her tonight. She's doing a great job keeping the ball out of that. Gabri on the sideline. Okay, she's dribbling through. Hyora sending it over to Hesse. You got Sandland kicking it out to Boyle. Boyle doesn't quite get it. Hayora with another boot to the right side of the field. Someone's going to settle the ball. Yeah, Boyle just sending it up. Who is there, though? Who is there? Lasquez sends it to Dever. Now she is running up the right sideline. Sharks take it to the left to Hyora. Getting it back to Higgins. Hesse has the ball, switching, looking to switch. You see my sense to Kelsey. And open. Lyon stops it at the 40 yard line. Looking. Smooth. Boyle is sprinting down the left side. But defender Leah Nash is not any by it, but Boyle has kicked it back. Looks for the shot. Beautiful shot by Boyle. She does not seem happy with the outcome, but it was a great shot. Ganshaw, sending it back up the field. We have seen a an amazing game by Boyle so far, both on defense and offense. Tough call. Con the foul on Velasquez. Seems to be it. We got senior Abby Wallace going in the game. Got Sandland taking it about the 50 yard line. Is that where to send it? Sharks are getting it out. Of the defensive play again. Velasquez is trying to settle the ball. Velasquez is having a great game. Beast's ball here at the 30 yard line. Looks like number 15 on Mr. Z's Hannah Blake will be taking this. So 
down to two, Kelsey Olsen, who is just on a breakaway. Oh, oh gosh. Oh, just barely misses the net. Oh gosh. Looking like a promo. Olsen's determined to put one in there. Not tonight. Looks like Abby Wallace is coming in for Kelsey Olsen. Cool kick. Sandlin will be taking a cheese. Tell me player's move. Look for the pass. Sends it to the left sideline. So keeping it in. Game shot. Looks like Hannah Slater will be coming in tonight for the Sharks. And Laura kicks up the field, but 11. McSorley keeps it in. Higgins has the ball. Gamshaw has the ball. She's taking her time for who she's going to send it to. Sharks are looking down the wing tonight, trying to keep it out of the middle. Sharks have the ball, right? Maggie Dever has the ball right in the six-yard line. Send it to Abby Wallace. Abby Wallace shoots. Oh gosh, it did not make it in. No. We got Hyora with the ball. Gives it off to Hesse. To Abby Higgins. Give and goes right back to Hesse. Um, we got the step by Katie Ganshaw. Uh oh. Boot by Hyora. To Mac Dever at the 40 yard line. Lions, Lions settles the ball, sends it up the wing to Velasquez, which couldn't quite get there. We've got Wallace with the ball. She's on a breakaway. She's on a breakaway. Shoots the ball. Oh, with a save by the keeper. Oh, but Hesse was looking for that rebound. Keeper just prances right on it. We got subs Hannah Slayer and Kelsey Olsen going in, along with East number eight, Julia Murphy. Subs are coming in now. We got Slater in for Hyora. Um, Murphy in for. Number five on East, and Olsen in for Hesse on the Sharks. Score still 1-0 with 16 left in the half. Um, got one more sub, number 13. Ryan Height going in for number 12 on East. Both teams are keeping some fresh legs in the game to hopefully put one in the net. Sharks are doing a really good job of keeping the ball in their possession today. We got Boyle going up the field. No one is stopping her except Ganshaw steps through. Higgins has the ball. 
Looks for the pass, sends it to Melissa, but the defender hits back up the field, hits the Sharks' territory. Oh, gosh. Ross was looking for that offsides call, but it wasn't there. Kelsey Olsen with the header. It's a 1v1 versus Wallace and Sandland, but Sandland seems to hit the ball back out. Melissa steps in. Doesn't quite make it. Higgins has, oh, foul on Higgins. Seems to have been a push, is what the refs think. I don't know. But we got Sandland taking the kick. Dever has ball. Get it towards the middle. Olsen. Put the ball up the left wing. Sending it in, but the defender stops it. Boyle has the ball. Double team. Slater has the ball, settles it. Oh, offensive finish. Wallace is on a breakaway. Come on, come on. She's looking for the finish with a goal! Abby Wallace on her senior night with a goal. Is now 2 0. Sharks take the lead. Yeah. Time ow, ow, out. <laughs> My coworker is letting is sharing her blanket with me now. Oh, time freezing. 
East has the bomb, but it's out. We got Lions on the throw in for the Sharks. Oh, oh it's a white girl. I don't know. Ooh, side of that. Listen. Games off steps. Maggie Dever goes for looks for the header, but lets it by to Velasquez. Number 22 on East hits it, and she got the roll in for the Sharks. Kitten Lions and Dakota Hesse come in for Sharks ups. East throw in. We got some more slips and flutes for the Sharks. Sam Mahoney and Lucy Ryan recommend. Subs are going in. It's a Sharks ball. A battle for the ball at the 40 yard line. One of them was doing a great job of getting back and keeping the ball. Oh. 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 Coach Astrology seems to get the ball to boil. And boil to get the ball in the net. Dever has the ball. Looks for the. Oh! Time to tap the walls. I lost it! Oh! No! That one just crossed the goal. We just needed one more touch to get in. The Sharks are really working hard tonight. Sturgis is not giving up tonight. They're really looking to put one in the net. She's like not telling me. Yeah, so uh, the ball's out, but we got an East throw in. Wasting no time, sending it up the field. Sharks ball. Oh, nope, East ball. I don't know what happened there, but. You're right, Liam. Sturgis is not wasting any time tonight. Mm, Kelsey Olsen has the ball, sends it off to Maggie Dever. Maggie Dever is looking up the field to make a pass. Sends it off to Lucy Ryan. Lucy Ryan is going to look for the pass, but East has the ball. Maggie Dever with a nice save, but looks like the goalie won't be hitting this. Number five on Sturge East is coming in. Out on East, Ryan will be taking the throw in. Ryan lets the ball out, so it will be a shark throw in. One 
Tom White's doing a really good job tonight of working together. And not letting Sturgis get the ball. Ganshaw sprinting to the ball, which is at the 20-yard line. There's no goalie in the net, but Monomoy's defense manages to keep it. Both Katie and Josie Ganshaw do a really great job of communicating to each other. A Sharks goal kick taken by Leah Nash. School. Leah Nash has done a great job tonight of getting the ball out of the defense. East has the ball here down at the left corner, but it is out by Hesse, and now it is an East ball. It looks like Boyle will be taking the throw in for East. We got a substitution on East. Wallace is going for the ball, bringing it up the field. She is gone. She is gone. is taking the ball back out, looking for a nice pass. Sends it to Hesse, oh, but the touch just doesn't seem there. It was a good run, good run. Possibly off sides? Not quite sure yet. go. <laughs> Yeah, it'll be a goal kick <laughs> um, for East. Sandlin's taking it again. She's taking all of them tonight. Nash has the ball on defense. Sends it, tries to get it through to Lions, but five on East stops it. Kelsey also now has the ball at the 40 yard line. She's gone, she is gone. Up, uh, but Sandland steps to the ball. It's called offsides by the ref. There's only four minutes and 30 seconds left in this half. Mm -hmm. Smart play by Leah Nash, just quickly sending it out to Lucy on the right side. Lucy Ryan playing very smart, letting these balls go, getting the Sharks a throw in. Sends it over East Heads to Wallace. Higgins is getting the ball. Nice step by Mahoney on defense. Giving it back to Kelsey Olsen. Warren sent it out wide to Hesse. Hesse's looking for the pass. Hesse heads it over to Wallace. Wallace makes a turn. The ball off to Higgins with a step by a East defender. Kelsey Olsen, no shocker, has the ball again. Ryan has time, settling the ball. Boyle on East is trying to get past defender Nash. We got number five on East taking a shot. Ganshaw was ready. 
Kelly and both teams have been keeping up the hard work and intensity throughout this whole game. Sturgis has not given up. Yeah, that is true. We got number 12 on East, wide open. Jersey Gantra is not letting anything by her tonight. Slid towards the ball. Seems to have knocked it over in East forward, but it is a shark ball. East's coach does not seem to agree with this call, but not much you can do about it, so. Got number 22 on East. Hurt. She's back up again. She does shaking not it seem off. too happy about it, but she's shaking it off, staying in the game. East better move fast. It is down to the two minute marker, less than two minutes left in this game. And East still is not letting up at all. Katie Yantra is doing a great job of keeping it out. Of the oh no. Oh, that was a close one for East. Ganshaw had had the ball, but somehow managed it. Ma an East player managed to kick the ball towards the empty net. Had it been a little closer, would have been a goal. So yeah, as this game is approaching an end, we just want to thank everyone who came out tonight. Everyone who's watching the stream, obviously. And for our hardworking Sharks who have taken the victory tonight. What, what looks like will be the victory tonight. I mean, you never know. But yeah, thanks. Thanks for everyone coming out tonight. Been great. Good game. Great senior night for these girls. Congratulations to all five seniors on Lanamoy. Great effort by both teams tonight. And that's good. The Sharks are sprinting down to get their goalie. Nice win, Lady Sharks. Oh, no. Oh, no. We have Maggie Deborah dancing. <laughs> but, yeah, um, that was a 2-0 to zero game. Great job to both teams. Great work. Great effort. The intensity is very high. And we'll see you next time. Signing off. Thanks, fans.